Shalom, Shalom, Israel. First of all, I'd like to give all honor and glory to Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shah. Today, we come back with a quick video on uh, Never Trust on Enemy. The first verse I'd like to hit the book of Ecclesiastes of Sir Sirach in the Apocrypha. Sirach 12 and 10. Never trust on enemy for as li for like as iron rusted, so there's wickedness. Now, if you if you ever had something that was like true iron, and you just like um like um uh kept uh kept coming back to it, like uh, you would leave it somewhere, kept coming back to it. Like the first day uh, you got it, it would look up nice, but like leave it there for some months, it's gonna be uh like all moldy. And like uh, just rust it up, so that's how you should uh, treat your enemy. I mean, it's like okay, it's like that's how your enemy is. They will uh, seem all nice and per perfect at first, and but like just give them some months or some days or some years, and the the wickedness will show. But um, get the book of Psalms, chapter fifty-five, verse twenty-one. The words of his mouth are smoother than butter, but war was in his heart. So, so yeah, your enemy's gonna be um like probably they're gonna be like nice to you, like um if like uh they're like a uh, sociopath or something like that, and they like find a way to, like to be nice to you or something, and, like just say nice things to you, but like in their heart they really want to hurt you. Reading on, his words were softer than oil. Yet yeah, were they drawn swords? Yeah, so like uh, he just uh wants to please, like seemed like he wants to please you, but really uh he wants to uh, destroy you. So never trust an enemy. But I like to give all honor to Yahweh, Shalom.